in while discussing fluid properties any characteristic of a control system is called a property some familiar properties are pressure temperature volume and its mass so the pressure is denoted by p the temperature by t and volume by uh, v as we are familiar so these are typical characteristic of a fluid system that is under consideration so as i have said earlier some other place that we can choose a control system arbitrarily which is typical of the fluid representative that is under discussion fluid properties list and it's it can be very uh, exhaustive and it can be extended to include things like viscosity thermal conductivity modulus of elasticity thermal expansion uh, coefficient electric res resistivity and even velocity and elevation so these can also be associated with fluid properties properties are considered to be either intensive or extensive so there are broadly there are two categories of properties that are normally discussed and that we come across one is called as intensive property intensive properties are those properties of the fluid that are independent of the mass of a system such as temperature pressure and density the temperature pressure and density are independent of mass of the system whether it's a small or it's big you will have the same value for a typical control system that we are considering extensive properties are those uh, that are depending on the size or the extent of the system so they are not independent of mass of system but they are dependent on the size uh, so therefore uh, they are called as extensive properties extensive properties per unit mass are called specific properties uh, they are things like specific volume which is measured as v over m the total volume or divided by mass and similarly the specific total energy will be the total energy divided by mass that is under consideration